Hi, I'm Kenny Joya. Welcome to another one of my tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create custom click track sounds in Reaper. Now you probably already know to use a click track in Reaper, we go up to this button over here and turn it on. If we hit play, we hear the click track. Turn it off, and we don't. We can adjust the settings for the click track by right clicking the button, which opens up this dialog. We could turn it on during playback or recording from over here. We could set it up for a count in. We could adjust the volume over here and the pattern over here. We could also change the sound over here from 800 hertz and 1600 hertz as the secondary sound. We can make it higher or lower. We can make it harder or more of a triangle wave or back to normal. We could also use custom sounds over here, just by browsing on a hard drive. But to audition the sounds, let's go to the Media Explorer. In the View menu, Media Explorer. And that opens up this window. And I've already created a sound library for me. Let's go to my percussion sounds, and let's find a good sound for a click. A cowbell, a lower cowbell, some snaps, some wood blocks. These sound pretty good. Let's use 12 as the accent and 13 as the click. So we'll go back to that dialog and choose browse for the accent. Then we could just find it on our hard drive. Double click it, and it brings in the file path for that sound. So now the click sounds like this. Let's change the other sound as well. We'll use 13. So now we created a custom click track based on our own personal sounds. So now we could use this however we want. And it's going to work at any tempo, go faster, or slower. And we can change the pattern as well. Let's change it to this. Or this. Or anything you want. Let's try two different sounds. This time we'll choose 27 and 33. And we could change the volume of our custom sounds up here. So we can change the click sounds to any sounds we want. And just to be clear, the sounds we're hearing are my sounds, but you can find plenty of samples for free on the internet. So anyway, that's how to create custom click track sounds in Reaper. I hope you learned something. Hope you could use it. And I'll see you next time. Thanks.